guys, just wanted to come to you really quickly with my Dollar General haul. I don't usually do this. I'm not a couponer, but I just wanted to show you guys. It's Thanksgiving week. I've had company here. So whatever you see in the house, excuse it because this was the best lighting I could find. So anyways, Dollar General, I hate that it's only on Saturdays, but it's 5 off 25. And that's when I usually go get my household supplies, my tissue, my paper towel, my dish detergent, my laundry detergent. Nothing special, but for 5 off 25 deodorant, toothpaste, mouthwash, I also clip coupons. Not a lot. I don't do those off $2 coupons and all that stuff. I had $1.50 off the Sparkle, plus Dollar General was offering $0.50 cent off a of Sparkle. So I got the six roll of, or nine, six equals nine roll of giant paper towels. So I got $1.50 off and Dollar General's $0.50 cent off coupon, and that brought it down. It was regularly $6, so that brought my price down. The Charmin. The Charmin was $4.99. I had a Charmin coupon, $4.95. I had a Charmin coupon for 50 cents off, I think. And then there was a Dollar General coupon for another $1.50 off the Charmin. Okay? Like I said, nothing major, but these coupons do help. I'm not an extreme couponer because it gets on my nerves, but I will do little coupons, the Dollar General coupon, and that 5 off 25 helps. I walked out of there paying $23, and that's with tax. I got my Gain dish detergent. I had a coupon for Gain, and they also had a coupon for Gain. So I got the Gain, not dish detergent, washing powder. Um, I did get the Dawn dish detergent. I had a coupon for the Dawn, and they also had a coupon for the Dawn, so I was able to get the large one. Usually I get the small ones from the Dollar Tree. I did get my Listerine. And I did get my degree deodorant. One for me, one for my husband. We do use the same deodorant. Don't know if that's weird or not, but it works for me and it works for him. Um, I got the Dollar General brand of pads, um, lady items. They had $3 off, $3 off any Dollar General purchase or something like that. Like they have their own coupons. I have the Dollar General app on my phone. This was not included, but I got this to go on the, you see the bar back there? The bar is actually decorated with like a whole Christmas theme. So I got this to go on the bar. I tried to find one in the Dollar Tree, but I couldn't find one. This one was only $3, but I thought it was really, really cute. So I just wanted to come tell you guys, Dollar General and Family Dollar. I don't have a Family Dollar near me. The one that was near me closed down because of rats, so I was freaking out. And it's right by my job. I used to go on my lunch or on my way home to Family Dollar, but they are closed. So until they reopen, I used to do both. If I had Family Dollar 5 off 25, I'd go there. If I had Dollar General 5 off 25, I'd go there. But now it's just Dollar General. Um, it's one exit from where I live, and it's only on Saturday. So it takes me five to seven minutes to get there not bad to save money i do the manufacturer's coupon the dollar general coupon and then the five off 25 so just want to let you guys know don't sleep on dollar general don't sleep on family dollar i ain't afraid to say that my household items come from there: tissue dish detergent laundry detergent mouthwash deodorant you still spend less than going in the dollar tree and you get more you get more bang for your buck trust me and you can walk out of there sometimes i price it just right Five at 25 with all my coupons. Sometime I walk out there paying exactly $20. Like I keep track of what I'm spending. And when I hit 25, I'm done. I'm done because I got a five off 25 and I only want to spend $20. And I've done it before today, 23. But I think it was because of this that brought it over a little bit. Check it out, you guys. Family Dollar has an app. Dollar General has an app. You can clip your coupons and just put your phone number in when you get to the register. You don't have to walk in with a bunch of coupons and a bunch of papers unless you have some manufacturer ones. You put your phone number in when the cashier rings you up and all your digital coupons come up. Don't sleep on it. If you guys know any other tricks to the trade, let us sister know because I'm all about saving a buck. And I'll see you guys in the next video.